What's up? Why 30 minutes? Because I'm going somewhere in 30 minutes. Mirror streak in streak uh, 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 alpha factor O dot O two. Mirror streak alpha factor. That O2. Gameplay visuals mirror streak alpha factor. Bro. Bro, we're adding an alpha factor. It's like the X factor, but different. Okay, so now I can tune this. I can go mirror streak alpha factor 1.0. Oh. Okay, so now let's open that bitmap. I want to make sure the bitmap is being drawn in the correct order. Let's load it up. Let's paint one end of it purple. How do I make a real big brush? Can I change my brush size in this frickin' program? Size. Okay, well that's great. Okay, I'm just trying to make sure that this is purple on one end. Yes. Okay. Well, let's just try something real weird. Let's do a little rainbow here. This is going to be a high quality artist rainbow. Red, orange, yellow. Well, we already got yellow, but you know. Green, blue, well it looks terrible but it still looks better than it did. Um, hella aliasing there. Okay, so now instead of e having each streak be like a equal bar, we'll paste them out uh, and we're going to just abuse the particle system properties. We're going to use the theta. not going to have any spin on them. We may add some because that'll move it. But for right now, so we're going to pick a theta for each thing. And we're going to do the following. Uh, we're going to adjust each streak. So we're going to say, uh, We're going to say streak fraction. They're all going to be the same length for now. And it's going to be 0 dot 5 and streak. Say 0 dot 4 streak. Uh, multiply. 
margin or streak empty one minus streak fraction. Okay, so for each of these, we're going to say um, theta is uh, theta t is it dot theta divided by 360 clamp theta t between 0 and 1 um, and then uh, x0 world plus equals theta t times dir world space uh, times uh, theta t plus streak empty oh you know it's, this is all going to be a fraction of uh, okay. So x zero world, right, and then x one world is x zero world plus. Uh, streak fraction times streak length times their world space. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, we went backwards somehow. They're all going behind. It does look better, though. Why are we going behind? <sighs> Their world space points the wrong way, so we need to subtract. Oops. Okay, that's even worse. It's like out in space. Ladies and gentlemen, we are floating in space. Okay, disaster. Disaster. All right. Uh, base x0, base x1, delta. Dur world space is delta. Okay, so. Dir world space goes from x0 to x1. Okay, so x0 All right. Boom. Theta t plus streak empty. Wait, theta t times streak empty. I still don't understand. why it was going the wrong way. It's probably still not right. Well, it's right. Okay. That's great. So 
So it changes discontinuously. And in general, so even if we fix that discontinuity and it moves smoothly with you, I'm not sure if the streaks stretching is a good look as opposed to just having more fading in and out. The problem with having more fading in and out is I don't really know how to do it without keeping extra state. But maybe we could do that. Maybe we can poke some state onto the particles. Okay. Let's make this a better texture now. We're going to we're going to open the big guns. Okay, first of all, let's rename it. I was using this old texture, but let's call it uh, mirror streak. Yeah. And we're going to rename this rename mirror streak. We're going to open Photoshop. One, two, three, four, and four something. All right. Um, and we're going to go erasing some things. And we're going to have it be mostly like a white streak. Whoops. Whoops. Let's go. Let's make us wider. Let's go 64 by 256. No, other way around. Let's go 256 by 64. Let's go 128, 512. Could have left the lock on for that. All right. All right, people. We're going to go like, what? What? Actually, let's, let's have some. We'll have some appear and disappear, appear and disappear, and, you know, woot, and we'll erase all this stuff, and this is pro artwork. I hope you guys appreciate, you know, this is an educational stream, and I'm really teaching people how professional game development is done. Um, you know, and I hope, I hope you all, why, why am I inversed? Oh, cause I'm still on eraser. I'm an eraser head today. Photoshop, Photoshop, mo how do I make this a, why is it so different? I'm just, let's go, let's go there. Yeah. Okay. 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 And then, yeah. Get this out of my face. And then we'll even make little, little baby streaks.
Okay, dude, I have no idea. Save it. Compile it. Run it. Chalk is the best default Photoshop brush, maybe. Okay. That's something. See? Now here's what I think. As we put a little we get a stew going. Let's multiply by layer one. I don't know. I don't fucking know how this works, but if I do a multiply on layer two and I put some yellow in there, why can't I not? Increase my keep hitting B. Did they change it so B isn't brush anymore? Is that what's screwing me up? Dude, I'm trying to multiply. How do I make this multiply the layer below it? What the hell does fill? I don't want any fill opacity. I just want to multiply the color. That's not doing any, dude, Photoshop is so crappy. Jesus. Multiply and clip. Well, now that I set the fill to, how do I multiply and clip? Alt-click between the layers. That's not doing anything. It's the last time I take Photoshop advice from the stream. Create clipping mask. Ah, okay. Okay, this is what we were talking about. Thank you. Doesn't make any sense, but that's okay. Whoa, let's get, okay, okay. We're just getting a little yellow. Don't eat the yellow snow. Out where the huskies go. That joke, despite the fact that it's a Bill Cosby joke, which is its whole own thing, now would also be cultural appropriation, so it would get everybody on Twitter really mad. You're not allowed to make a joke about yellow snow unless you're of Aleutian descent. It's a little too yellow, maybe. Wait, is, is Yellow Snow Frank Zappa and not Bill Cosby? Wait, what? I thought it was Bill Cosby. Hold on. It's Frank Zappa. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We don't know yet if Frank Zappa dropped drugs in people's drinks. It is, however, cultural appropriation. So why was I thinking Bill Cosby? That's so weird. Bill Cosby is uphill in the snow both ways. Maybe I associated it that way.
Oh yeah, don't get us started about kung fu fighting, man. Everybody was kung fu fighting. Do, 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 do. So this isn't good by any means. But it's a start. See how it looks on the actual mirror levels. Well, it's going to need to be a little stronger to read. Alpha factor 100. Yeah! 30. Okay. Five. Why do we have no anti-aliasing there? I guess because it's all in the frickin' texture. I don't know, man. Okay. Oh, and it, yeah, see the streaks change right now. That's not so good. So we're going to have to come up with some model. Like when you transport, I think the streaks should stay as they are. The thing is the mirror direction reverses. So that's going to be... Dude, that little camera pan out. That's like some pro shit, all right? That's like, that's like below right there. Like when he just goes on the thing and it's like, whoop. Takes a little too long right now. What? Victory transition time. Yeah, it's basically, we're ready to ship this. Why does that, oh, it's like waiting till his freaking animation finishes, what? Yeah, it's waiting till his animation finishes. That's really the thing. See, we don't, we don't want that. Let me write that on the list. We're not doing it tonight, but uh, victory. Slow due to animation. Wait. Actually, you know what? I bet we could do that right now. Uh. Where is check for victory? There it is. Start waiting for victory. I don't see anything that makes it look like we're waiting for animations. And why?
Why is that there, dude? Start waiting for victory. Victory wait time remaining. Dude, this, this should be in update. Got to update your pup date right there. See, we just start working on one thing and then we're working on another thing. Before you know it, the game's done and 15 years have passed and you're old and you never had a fun life like everybody else. You know, you never managed to get addicted to opiates like everybody else. You know, it's, it's like that. It's rough. It's rough. So instead of having the color in the texture, I could put the color in the particles and then it could vary per streak a little bit and that would give it some more character. Look how fast that one happened. I guess I fixed the problem. I don't know how. I guess I want to turn that delay back up. Look at that. It's too fast now, man. I think I was resetting it every frame. I was restarting the victory timer every frame while he was still animating. And now that I no longer call that once we're in waiting for victory state, This is going to have to be like four, six. Yeah. Let's go like five, seven. The longer timer is for the these worlds, which I don't know. Uh, that one, that one we want, we want this to feel responsive. Yeah, okay, that's better. And then here, eh, I can't go. I feel snappy. See, we make things better here at Better Corporation. I just wrote this big thing on my list and now I'm crossing it off. Mirror progress victory timer fix. Bro. Stream's been live for 30 minutes, so we're in bonus time. So wait, did IGN give a bad review to something? Okay, so in, in our bonus time here, I'm about to leave soon, but six out of 10 to below, fuck them, dude. I mean, this is the thing, right? Numeric scores like that are not appropriate because on the one hand, yeah, the game's a little rough to, to play on the other hand, it is really amazing and special in some dimensions, far beyond what other games are. 
So if someone says, I want to play a really special game, I would say, well, play this one. So that kind of puts it in the top ranks of games of all time, even though I don't agree with the things that the design does, right? So what does that mean? I don't know. I mean, there is no way, like I said, in terms of mood and feel and general polish, only below and inside, both of which are like prepositions talking about spatial relationships, which is weird. Um, both of those games are like, they're the pinnacle of video games in, in that direction. Like even including AAA games, like no AAA games are that good in those dimensions, right? It's amazing that independent developers can do that. Um, so like you're, you're not educated in games if you haven't played those games because you don't know what games can even do in that direction, right? So like, you have to play it if you want to know what the hell is going on. So rating it six out of 10 doesn't seem appropriate. You know what I mean? I'm gonna have to put it on my Steam game recommendation list and basically say what I just said. Like, like if you're an artistic director for games and you haven't played inside and you haven't played below, you're not doing a good job at prepping for your job, you know? Anyway, that's my rant. I assigned below a no numeric score out of 10. I assign it I divided by one. And Brad Shoemaker's into the game so far. Is he still a giant bomb? Well, thanks, giant bomb, for having taste. Fuck, man. A reviewer called your story so-so. Despite having a killer Santa Claus in it, there's no killer Santa in the story. Quality game review. Nan out of ten. There you go. <laughs> Nan out of ten. Killer Santa Claus, that's like the anti Mary Gear Solid. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's put some, as they say into tape heads, let's get into trouble, baby. Hope you guys have seen that movie. Okay, so now we're going to have some color variation. All right. And I'm going to take the color out of the texture. And we're just, we're just going to have that for now. So let's go back to Photoshop. I will leverage my expert Photoshop skills to turn off the tinting. And save it as a Pixar file. No, no, no Pixar files for us. We are not Pixar. Okay, so now we have to actually use the colors. Um, let's 
So instead of streak color, we say color is uh, it dot color. Oh, 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 oh. Let's call this. Because these are the things that happen when, uh, when like you try to teleport into a wall. So we want to multiply the full colors by those. Um, do I have a component wise? Component wise product, but only for vector threes. And uh, not even in the game. So, vector four. W, W, W. Streak, multiply, color. Color is component wise. Product, product, pro, pork products. Static vector four, that's C++. This is not C++, what? What am I doing? We should make a generic version of this that takes like any. That would be baller. Let's do that. I'm gonna put that on the list. We're not doing that because I gotta go, but. That'll be fun. It'll be fun. Okay. Uh, Result, boom. Hey, look at that, it's a little too yellow. Okay, that's fine. We'll go into the particle system. We'll select this. We'll, uh, it's hard to judge from here because it looks so different. But in our colors, um, can't we bias the colors? I guess not. We don't have good color control yet. That's the thing. We could do color A, color B. For now, I'm just not going to make this so damn yellow. And then we'll tweak it later. We'll do it live. Oh, I should really look at it on Mirror Isles anyway, right? Because this is not a typical. Yeah, it's too yellow. And we don't. Whoop. We don't have good control over distribution of colors yet. Uh, but yeah, we've, we've got several things to do, but this is a good, a good step, man. Look at this, it's gonna be a good game someday. Look at this shit. It's 
looks like somebody might want to play this. Almost. Not really, but, you know, we'll get there. Why isn't the exit freaking lighting up? What? Fuck you. What did you guys do to the exits? What did you guys do to the god... Okay, that one's fine. Let's turn on cheats. That one's fine. That one's fine. Wait. Why didn't it... So why didn't it light up when I stepped on it? I don't know. Oh, it was my mirror guy. Ha ha. I'm so fooled by the veracity of the illusion that we've been carefully constructing here. Okay, yeah, this looks pretty bad. So we're going to have to, like, um, let's make a list of what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to, like, actually z-test this. Z test streaks um, we'll do our fun component wise multiply we'll uh, color control on streaks actually before even color control we just want continuity and all that and you know what we may abandon using the particle system, honestly, because we're not using it for that much. We could just basically have the mirror streaks Yeah, I think we might just stop pretending that we should use the particle systems. But anyway, uh, streaks continuity before we do that we can adjust the streaks so that they don't uh, So that they don't, um, you know, update discontinuously like this. And I think the real way to do it, like you want the effect to be cool and stuff, right? So I think like we leave some streaks in there generating at this normal rate. And then when you go an extra square, maybe some smaller, faster streaks like appear, you know, like to kind of fill the space. And then as time evolves, it gradually fills out into this more general thing. And so that way it feels responsive. And like, if you go in, you'll like break the streaks a little bit, you know, maybe they'll shorten or disappear real fast, you know? Like if each of them is an individual little entity that kind of responds to you, that'll be cool. So yeah, I think we're not really going to use the particle system for this. So some of that work is wasted, but that's fine because it got us to where we are today. And that is an okay place. So street continuity, and we're just going to put that on the list and then we're going to see afterward. Wow, it's been 45 minutes. I said 30, it's been 45. We're going to sign off. This is what happens when we get rolling. Streak work. Streak work makes the geek work. Why hasn't AI been used properly in games like deep learning and stuff? Because it's hard to know how to apply it. Although these days, some people have some good ideas. You'll see games using deep learning in the next couple of years. As you move out of line with the mirror, the streams of streaks should disappear horizontally. Yeah, I agree with that. But they can stick around. They can still be tracked so that if it starts disappearing and you move out and then back in line, it'll just like, maybe it'll continue disappearing, but still be there. Or maybe it'll come back, right? Um, that would be fun. All right, let's see who to raid. We got our extra little feature in. Let's go to science and technology. 
30 minutes, you guys got a bonus 15 minutes. Code Wars learning Python. Ah, Sefer still has some people from our last host. We can host him again, but I assume a lot of people who are here uh, left from him. So we won't toss you back there. If you want to go back there, you could do that. Um, I think maybe random projects in Rust. Oh, God. I don't know about that. How do people feel about that? Doesn't seem like he's talking. We have raided him before, but I don't know what it was like. I don't remember. Solo FRTS game dev. Yeah. See. C sharp. Let's do this. All right. Thanks for coming by. Maybe we'll do another late night stream. Maybe we'll do one tomorrow. Hard to say. See you later. Hey, C-sharp is better than JavaScript, man. <laughs> <laughs>